<laughs> so nimeingia live 4 minutes early just to wait for people to start coming in we already have six people <laughs> hello 10 people Eleven, so I'm supposed to go one, but size in three minutes. Hello, Julie and Davis. Hi, welcome to my live. I'm waiting for people to flock because we still have time. I have three minutes, two minutes right now. Monica Wanjiru. Hi, hello, <laughs> welcome to my live. I'm still waiting for more people. Valerie, Valeria Cheng, Ouma, hello, Rizfa, hi. Is this a Valerie I know from my childhood? I'm a Winimgani. <laughs> hi, Rizfa. Precious Paul, hi, Precious. I'm in a KV portrait because it's going to. Yeah. <laughs> Oh. Let me to put it like this. Hi, Rispa. Hi. Okay, waiting. Yes, I'm still waiting. Philomena Mugure. Hello. <laughs> Hi, Rispa. Hi. Hi, Sylvia Ken. Mbona watu wakini andikia zinapotea? Zinafaku kaapo ama. Akumbi, Mido, hello. So I'm still waiting for more people. We are 14 now. Tunenda live one. One, exactly one on the dot. How many more minutes? Still one. Uh, Yvonne Mukena, thank you. Hi, so welcome to my live. Um, I'm going to be live for one hour. Judy Mtua, I see you. Uh, Judy Mtua, I see you. Hi, hey guys, uh, welcome to my YouTube channel. And Rispa, that view is better. Thanks for encouraging, inspiring us to look great. Thank you so much, Sarah Semi. Hello, Rispa, you look good. Baroness Linda, thank you so much, Linda. Welcome to my live. So the before one, I kwa one kwa nimekaivi. Say hi to Don't Skip the Ads. <laughs> He's not around. Don't Skip the Ads. Amenda kuhasol. Amenda kutaftamkate. Yeah, so can we start now? Where are more people? Where are more people I'm waiting? I'm waiting. Anyway, let's start. We'll just save this video and share it on my YouTube so that the people who mixed Najwa Watwengi Wako job, they are working so hard. <laughs> yeah, for the people who will miss, we'll save the video and share it on my YouTube so that they can watch later. Cindy. So let's just jump. Today is Wednesday. It's Ladies' Day. Uh, Africom Entertainment. The Village Boy, the Comedians. Let's do some collabo, please. All right, no problem. Yeah, so let me shoot my points. I discuss them, and then you write your comments. I read while we discuss. Yeah, so today I'm here to talk about how to get yourself a wealthy man. I understand most of us lady are independent. You have your own money. You have your own shit going on. Sorry, not. I'm not supposed to use vulgar language. You have your life going on. You have your money. You have everything. But of course, you'll want to have a man who will uh, give you security for your future. I know, yes, you can get that security for your future. Kama mwanamke mwenyewe. Lakini, of course, if a man comes in, 
why not you know now so there's two type of men kuna rich man na wealthy man so rich man ni ule mwenye weekend hata kulipia rent nini weekend atakupeleka out mtakula mta enjoy mtafanya hizo vitu zote na kuna wealthy man who will give you a good bright future atakupatia security he'll bid for your house yani he put them on your name there's wealth generational of wealth hivyo vitu kama hizo yeah so I'm going to teach you how to get yourself a wealthy man and not just a rich man. Of course, I'm not saying a rich man is bad, but if you can get a wealthy man, then the better. I'm not uh, trying to portray, portray women as we can't be independent, get our own money and the, all, all that kind of stuff. All I'm trying to say is, if you get yourself a wealthy man, that's a plus, Ama. Yeah, hakuna mwanamke anapenda kuspend pesa yake. So, of course, kama kuna some things which can be kama kuna bills zinafaa kutolewa yani kuna mtu mwenye anaweza come in na kusaidie that baggage then well and good so point number one, when you reach a man when you meet a man they ask you what do you do for example hauna kazi ya kufanya hauna job saizo na maybe you're looking for something ama you you, you you don't have anything to do you don't say you're a model or a student First of all, if you say you're a model or a student, wataona kama ni student huyu atakuja baadaye niambie sina fee, sina school fees, so watataka walipe school fees. Alafu kusema model ni kama uko idol au you're not sure of what you do. What are you modeling for? Hmm? Hakuna kitu kama squeeze ya model, not unless unafanya na Victoria Secrets, big model being paid lots of money then that's a model lakini don't just say your model because umejiona tu kwa instagram unakapoa umengara then you call yourself a model don't say that when a guy ask you what you do what do you do hata danganya you can say i'm a businesswoman for example there's something in your head you've been inspiring to do for the longest time so unamka tu unasema for example i'm a businesswoman uh, Saizi nafanya online business na uza cosmetics zangu but uh, when the business grows nitachukua shop nifungue na ikuwe kubwa yeah so don't just say your model or a student of course there are students yes which is genuinely there are students but mtu mwenye amemaliza shule ako hiyo process ya kutafuta job ya kupata job don't say your model or a student jama atahepa atajua tu huyu huyu anataka ana kitu ya kufanya anataka tu kunyevia kwa sababu models models are flexible ukimwambia oh rispa I, i mean rispa can you come hang out with me today you say okay i can come yeah so when a guy ask you what you do don't say you're a model or a student not unless you're a student just lie you do a you do a business ama unafanya job pahali of course they won't go and uh, start researching all that stuff but just don't say your model that's point number one point number two uh if you want to get yourself a good man you can just sit in the house i like your humbleness girl i'll continue clapping for you until my turn comes your product ziko wapi hukutao i wish i can share your hand oh thank you so much yeah so point number two where uh, where you hang out matters the most uwezi katu kwa nyumba huh Uwezi katu kwa nyumba na u expect wanaume wanyako na pesa wakujua kutafutia kwa nyumba no go out and hang out and why you hang out matters a lot always enda tu ku hang out kwa kibanda na u expect kupata mtu wa maana kwa kibanda no dress nicely kuna hizi wig expensive na wig cheap kuna hizi wigs cheap hata zinauzwa 3000 2000 unaweza ziva na uzi style vizuri na uende ukae place uende hang out place nzuri for example you can go hang out at Kempinski of course auna hiyo pesa ya kwenda ku hang out Kempinski what do you do you go to Kempinski you buy yourself a glass of wine don't be don't be full easy vitu si expensive not unless you're buying by the bottle is what is expensive but ukifika hivi Kempinski uitishe a glass of wine ni kama 350 bob kapo usweep sip on your wine you can ask for wine and dessert dessert unaweza itisha cake kama cheesecake cake yoyote any dessert so you're eating your dessert pole pole while sipping on your wine but don't just sit at kempinski and looking like eh sijui kitu yenye unafanya watch out kwa kempinski just pretend like you're busy umengavi umevaa vizuri umengara pretend you're busy 
eating your dessert, sipping your wine, listening to the good music, checking your phone, evil. But usikei tu ni kama tu, oh, nimekuja tu hapa hivi kutafuta tu mwana umeana pesa, apana. Pretend like you're busy. So, let's say for example, nimeda kempiski, nimeitisha waini yangu ya 350, na dessert yangu ya 250. That's 550, Bob. Yes, so, ukikapo hivyo, ukisip, then... Always, kuna our wealthy men wana kujaizi places, they come for lunch, business meeting. Someone will approach you if you're looking good, your, your hair looks on point. Hmm? Your hair looks on point, umbengara, unakapoa. A guy will come and approach you. And then they're like, oh, can I join you? Then you say, yeah, you, sure, you can join me. Then akikuliza, what are you having? I say, Ma, I was just having my wine and dessert. Uh, I just had my food and I'm just finishing on the dessert. I'm about to leave. I just came here to treat myself. Simple and clear. Sio yati, oh, nimekuja tu kukaa, sikuwa na kitu ya kufanya leo, nimekuja tu kwa mwa kukaa. No, pretend like you're busy. I just came to treat myself out for lunch and I'm about to head out. Jamata kwambia, can I join you? Can I add you a glass of wine? Na saizo, kama unasikia nja, kaa nyumbani, ukule, ushibe kabisa. Kula ugali yako na samaki, ushibe kabisa. Ukenda kempinski, awendi kempinski kama uko nanja. Kwa sababu food ni expensive. You don't want to spend 10,000 which you don't have. Enda ka kempinski na uku, nyumbani umekula ugali na samaki umejisunda uko tu sawa. So hapo unasipo sipo ni yako pole pole hivyo 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 tu. So, eh, pretend like you're busy. That's what I'm saying, Masi. So, akikuja kuuliza, can I buy you lunch? You say, no, I just had my lunch. I'm finishing on my dessert. Unaona? Kun, there's this word, uh, fake it till you make it. I remember when I was in Kiambu, uko Thindigwa, nilikuwa, nilienda isili, nika buy kiholder kiholder nyenye nakaa kama Mercedes Benz hiyo Mercedes Benz hiyo kiholder haikuwa kiholder ilikuwa lighter ilikuwa inakaa kama Mercedes Benz so kila time nikipiga picture naishika hivi kwa kwa nini kwa kwa picha zangu ndio mtu adhani niko na Mercedes mwenyewe hata sina Toyota hata sina motorbike hata sina bicycle you fake it until you make it acha niwaambie mmetoka ushago kuja Nairobi kufanya nini kuishi maisha mzuri hakuna mtu ataki maisha mzuri hakuna mtu anataka kusafa unaona so mimi napiga picha yangu na kiholder ki yangu ya Mercedes Benz so i remember when Brian was chatting me on Instagram hapo vile tulikuwa tunakatiana akaniuliza Rispa do you have a Mercedes because I'm a Mercedes Benz lover that's what he told me nikamwambia no i don't have a Mercedes Benz that was a lighter and then later on i was faking it on Instagram kuonesha niko na kifungo ya Mercedes lakini yenyewe gari yenyewe sina Saizi, as we speak, I have three Mercedes Benz. V350, niko na convertible, lakini ifunguki ju, alafu niko na C200. I have three Mercedes Benz. You know, na I faked it until I made it. Don't fake too much, yani kwe exaggerated apana. So, ako kakifungu kangu kalaita, kalini saidia, saizi niko na Mercedes Benz ngapi? Tatu. So, you fake it till you make it. All right. So where you hang out matters. Sip to Kempinski peke yake. You can go to Sankara. You can go to Hemingway's. Easy high-end restaurants. Just dress nicely. Usivai ni kama, usivai kama mtoto. Usivai ya ni vitamba apana ngara. Enda kwa Instagram kuna shops zina uzanguo 1,500. Enda mtumba gikomba. Chagua luku mzuri. Kuja nyumbani osha na star soft. Piga pasi vizuri nguo va. Ukifika hivi Kempinski, hata umeshukishwa na taxi, hawa watu wa vale. Vale ni yale watu wanakufungulia mlango na chukua gari yako anaenda kupaka. Wanaona huu ni mtu wa maana. The only no umetoka dhindigwa, hata jua umetoka thika, wanajua tu huyu ni msichana wa maana, umepaka makeup yako vizuri. Hizi makeup si expensive. Of course kuna high end na low end. So hizi makeup zenye si expensive ziko 1000 changa 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 nunua ka vizuri. Ukifika hivi ikifika hivi Kempinski Valea na kufungulia mlango ya taxi unaingia vizuri, umengara. Unaona top kama hii is so classy. Hii top ni 1500. It's so classy na yoneshi vitu matiti ya iko nje yani uko tu sawa unaona unakaa classy iko na pads yani iko na padded shoulders unakaa classy na umengara na hiyo ukiingia hivi Kempinski watu wanasema ah that girl looks expensive na wewe mwenyewe unatembea 
Unatembea unatembea unaenda unakaa chini una sweep on your wine. Mimi nawapatia tips nyinyi mnacheka shauri yenu. Aya so how you dress really matters. Usivae vitamba hapa hivi imefunika chini imefunika hapana. We don't want you to look like that. We want you to look classy because class attracts wealthy men. You understand? Mnashika chukweni kitabu na kalamu nyenye single women mwandike hizi vitu chini. Okay. So, let's say ume meet Jama mko hapo Kempinski mnaka mnaongea. Then uh, of course they'll be interested in asking you about your education. Hata kama umefika form 4, sikuizi kuna YouTube, kuna Google, Google some things. Mwambie nimefanya business eh umefanya business management enda google yani chukua kitu na u stick on it enda usome juu ya business management business law vitu kama hizo vitu zote ziko kwa youtube instead ya kwenda tiktok kuangalia ma tiktok videos hiyo bundles tumia kwenda kwa youtube jifunze vitu jifunze business management nini hata kama ujenda college nini nini soma hizo vitu akikuuliza what's your level of education nasema ama nini ama graduates i studied business and management cost hiyo yote yenye utuko interested nayo unaona eh cost hiyo yote tu yenye uko interested nayo unasema nimefanya business man management nime graduate but i don't have a job now but i be decided to i wish to meet you my all time mentor faith when thank you i decided to open my own business So right now I'm doing online business cosmetic na uzauza hapo hivyo then later on akiwa na interest na wewe akikuona ni msana mwenye uko na akili akili zako kwa sababu acha nikwambie hakuna wealthy man mwenye anataka msana amekaa nyumbani at just sitting pretty hakuna it's 21st century 21st century wanaume wanataka mwanamke mwenye analeta kitu kwa sahani kwa, I mean kwa kwa nyumba hata kama ni 1000 shillings si ati umekaa tu hivi nyumbani ati oh i'm pretty my husband will do everything for me hell no what you do ukiwa na periods kwani nani atakunulia utakol baby wako ako job ama ako business meeting anaenda ku sign deal ya 100 million na unampigia simu unamwambia hi baby I've started my periods. I need 200 shillings to go and buy myself pads. Hell no. Hiyo 200 shillings you can get from that online business. Hata kama unauza unauza 1000 bob per day, uko na sales za 1000 bob. Utachukua 1000 bob yako, wewe ununue pads. Usumbui bwana yako na vitu ndogo ndogo. Oh, baby, chakula imeisha kwa nyumba. Of course, <laughs> ataki watu wenye wanakaa tu kwa nyumba. Hmm? Hakuna watu hakuna mwanaume anataka mwanamke akaka kwa nyumba anataka mtu mwenye ataleta kitu mnaelewa so education is very important ukienda huko hata kama umefika form 4 uko na hiyo knowledge ya kusema nimefanya business nimefanya nutrition and dietetics unaona na unajua things about nutrition unaona lazima hata enda siju kwa shule kutafuta oh kweli risipa alisoma kweli ali graduate unajua vitu kama hizo yeah so you need to be very smart Be very smart. Hawa wanaume wataki mwanamke mwenye ako bongo lala hapa hivi. They want you to be very smart so that just in a case God forbid mmeoana mko pamoja akufe. Anajua ni macha mali yangu kwa mkono safe. Watoto wangu watakuwa safe, mali yangu itakuwa safe na hii generational wealth itaendelea. Uh, itaendelea for a long time. Yeah. So hiyo ni point number four. education. Mwambie umesoma. Aya. So mmekutana na huyu mwanaume He's interested in you. Eh? He's calling you and asking you on Saturday what are you doing? Can we go to Naivasha? Nabia no, I'll be busy. In fact, my stock is coming in on Saturday. I need to check on my stock. Yaani just pretend you're busy with your life. Si ati tu umekaa tu unangoja mpango. Rispa uko kwa nyumba. Unaweza kuja twende hivi pale. Be a, usikue available. Yaani wanasema ile commodity yenye available hivi tu hivi hivi watu waipendi. Watu wanapenda ukikuwa scarce. Unaona ama celebrity. Unakutananga nao kwa njia kila saa. Unaona ukikuwa scarce value yako pia inapanda juu. Unaona? So ujamata anasema ah this girl is very busy. Uh, when she, will she get time for me? Yeye anapenda mwanamke. Si ati mwanamke tu mwenye uko tu available. Akikupigia simu wewe kuja tu hang out ndio hiyo. Ado baby nimeboeka kwa nyumba au oh, niweza kuja ku hang out na wewe no they want you to look busy 
you pretend you're busy. Madam, hata kama una kitu ya kufanya, just pretend you're busy. Usiku available. You can see him this weekend, next weekend mwambie, I'll be busy, I'm doing something. Na unamwambia of course tunafanya kitu ya maana. You understand? Aya. Um, point ingine, ngojeni nikunywe maji. Mate isiche kwa mdomo. Point ingine, the way you carry yourself. The way you carry yourself is very important. Eh? Yani, be a lady. Uh, enda kwa YouTube. Ata, imagine uko Kempinski, umebaiwa prawns, umebaiwa seafood platter. Hmm? Umeka hivi Kempinski mwenye hauju kutumi cutlery. Ukifika hivi Kempinski, amekubaiwa ame, ame dina, kuna hizo vitambazi kwa hapo hivyo kwa meza. Zinaitwa napkins. Ndo hiyo, chukua napkin yako, wekelea hapa hivi vizuri. Unekelea hapa hivi, ndo, ukikula kula supu, isiangike kwa nguo, inanguka kwa hiyo napkin. Ama, kama utaki kuyeka hapa, weka kwa mapaja yako. Hmm? Unaona? So, uko Kempinski, unakula. Au, wezi chukua prawns, wanze kukula na yo mkono. Hapa, na unachoma. Usichome. Unachoma kwa nini? Usikule prawns zako, chakule yako na mkono. You need to have class. And the way you carry yourself really matters. So, ata kama ujuu kutumia hizo vijiko, uma, katlari, enda kwa YouTube. Jifunze. Achana na TikTok videos. Enda kwa YouTube to be a bundle zako kujifunza how to use the cutlery. So, umeitua hivi dina na mtu wako. Mtu wako wa maana. Ana kuodea chakula. You order your food and then it comes. Unachukua kisu. Unajua uma. Unashika na imu kono. Na kisu unashika na imu kono. Kama umeletewa steak. Uh, kuna steak knife na hizo. Ujifunza hizo vitu. Sababu, ah, of course, wendi kula kwa kibanda. Wanaenda kukupeleka fine dining. So, ukifika fine dining, usi chome. Jifunze kutumia hizo vitu. So, unachukua katilari yako. Unajua uma inashika na imu kono. Do inadunga kwa nyama. Alafu, unachukua imu kono ingine. Na kisu yako ya steak, unakata kidogo kidogo ukiuma. Na usitafune, mwa, mwa, mwa. Apana, tafuna with class. Hmm? Hmm? Usi the way natafuna. Aki kuongelesha kama uko in the middle ya kukula, ya, ya kutafuna. Usionge tu, oh, beka, na mamboga, nini, manyama zina ruka ruka pana. You take your napkin, weke kwa mdomo, then unaonge, unasema, yes baby, what were you saying? Ivo, unaona, class is everything. Is it small details nye naambia, ndia wealthy man wanaangalia by the way. Kwa sababu, autaki, autaki, mtu, mtu anajaribu kunikol. Autaki, wealthy man, amekupeleka dina na mabeste zake, mabilionea, meka hivi kwa meza, na weo unakula na mkono, unajipaka paka hivyo. Unaona, watu watu, au marafiki zake watu mwambia, what the hell, why are you embarrassing yourself? Unaona, but the, if they take you there to meet their, their friends, alafu unakula vizuri, you present yourself classy, umevapoa, the, our friends wake watu kwambia, this is a classy woman, you need to marry her. Unaona, we have to get that ring from that wealthy man. Na lazima, tupate pia hiyo pesa, ndo tusaidia watu wa nyumbani. Sawa, sawa. Ok, point ingine, mm, uh, goals where to see yourself. Yani, ukwe na goals. Unaona, umekai hivi na wealthy man. He? Anakai hivi, anakuuliza. Uh, where do you see yourself in five years? Usike etu hapo hivyo useme, uh, ata misi juin, machia tu mungu. Eh, it, is what it is what it is. It's just life. Eh? In five years, enya mungu atakuwa menipatia, ndo nisawa minta chukua. No. Mwanaume kikuliza, where do you say yourself in five years? Una muambia goals. So for, seme for instance, me muambia kona yo, cosmetic business. Unaona? So yo cosmetic business, una muambia, in five years, I would love to see myself globally. I want to grow my business. Sasa for example, kama umefika kwa iyo age ya kutaka kuwa married, hapo hivyo 27, 28, unona kama unataka kusettle, una muambia, in five years, I would love to see myself as a wife. I would love to see myself as a mother. Unaona? Ana kuambia, Anaona kili yako, inangalia mbele. Uni mwanamke mwenye ako na mpango. Sia tumeka tu hivyo tundeo, mungu watanibariki tu, na kitu nye itakuja, domini ita accept. You understand? So, you have to, you need to have goals. Na usiku unaji contradict. Whatever you tell him from the beginning is what you stick with it. Like I said, fake it till you make it. Ukidanganya mtu, unataka kufungua moto shop yako, in five years, ukweli. Eh? Huh? How wealthy men wako wapi wanite dead saini melan. 
Nimekwambia unaenda ku hang out kwa hivyo uh, places za maana. Unaenda ku hang out Sankara, unaenda ku hang out uh, Kempinski, unaenda ku hang out places nzuri nzuri, ma Westlands hizo ma hoteli nzuri nzuri. But ukikaa tu kwa nyumba siju unaenda Hornbill hapana, hakuna mtu mwenye atakuja huko hivyo hiyo place. Hiyo place utapata tutu uh, boys wa kawaida wenye watakupatia mimba, wakuache hapo hivyo mwenye umezalisha watoto mnampigia simu oh mtoto anataka diaper anasema siwe mwenyewe ndio utafute diaper oh si umkatie kitambaa ujimfunge kama diaper no we want to get ourselves wealthy men sawa sawa ati sasa huku bungoma tuta hang out wapi <laughs> bungoma pia kuna places expensive i'm sure kuna hoteli nzuri nzuri ha huh? yeah so how you carry yourself really matters okay point ingine mkikana huyo jamaa Kuha, you ha, need to have a meaningful conversation meaningful conversation si ati amekuita date anakuuliza hi baby how you doing how was your day unamwambia ah i'm so bored tumbo ina nyuma jana jana usiku nilikula ugali na miro yani imenichafukia tumbo yani nasikia tu kwenda enda cho yani that's not a meaningful conversation for example a meaningful conversation ni conversation kama hii Tuseme for example size current affairs watu wana uh, pesa ya kwenda those expensive hotels ndio inakosa dada nimewaambia ukitaka kwenda hiyo expensive hotel how need pesa mingi nakwambia unaenda kwa hiyo hotel na hata 1000 bob Kenya shillings you just sacrifice you save and sacrifice ukifika kwa hiyo hotel expensive itisha a glass of wine a glass of wine at Kempinski is 350 bob Kenya shillings and it, itisha dessert dessert angalia menu itisha dessert na glass yako ya wine dessert kempinski ni 250 bob kenya shillings a piece of cheesecake a piece of nini vanilla cake a piece of anything ukiumauma hivyo kidogo ukingoja time ikienda unaenda kwanza during lunch lunch hours wanakujanga ma lunch meetings vitu kama hizo I spend more than 2000 bob Kenya shillings. Uta spend 1000 bob Kenya shillings kukunywa glass of wine na kukula dessert. Usiende kuitisha chakula. Chakula is expensive. Utaenda pumosha mavyombo na vijiko kwa hoteli ya watu. Ama utaanza kupigia mamako nyumbani mwami mami nitumie pesa ya chama nilipe huku niko na deni hapana nimesema ukienda Kempinski ama ukienda Villa Rose uh, I mean ukienda Sankara ukienda place expensive just ask for a glass of wine cause a glass of wine is uh, classy and it makes you look classy and a dessert a piece of cake ivo usiende kuitisha chakula expensive nani understand not unless umepelekwa dinner na mtu nani elewa i think the people who are asking about that ndo wanaingia live size lakini mimi nasemaje ukifika huko just ask for a glass of wine red wine umeelewa sawa Okay. So nilikuwa nakwambia a meaningful conversation with these people because they want to see if you're smart hapa ama umebeba tu ugali kwa kichwa. Unaona? Ati nipeleke yeye pale kibandaski ya kule gideri ambao au sio. No. What are you doing in kibandaski na wealthy man? Huh? Ati umekula. Eh, hey, unaenda na yeye. <laughs> Ah, kupigi simu kuulize. Hi baby, where should we have lunch today? Eh, unamwambia ti kuja tu hivi mama mboga ame Ah, hapana, no. You should know these places in your watu wa pesa oh, na hang out wewe. Okay. So, meaningful conversation, that's my next point. Mnaongea juu ya current affairs. Unaona? Yaani anaona uko up to date, ne? Ni, ni mwanamke anajielewa, anajua vitu. Eh? Sawa, kama for example size KRA kuna story za KRS nyuna, kuna story za nini unakumwambia oh baby by the way did you read the magazine today did you see what the KRA people are saying oh my god yani current affairs vitu za maana eh um, how do you see about covid history of covid do you think it's true have you gotten yourself an injection for uh, vaccine for covid uh, kama amakwambia no unasema why yani vitu by the way you're correct rispa uh, you're correct ukizoea ku hang down 
utapata tu wa guy chip wa kukupeleka Grogon. But ukienda uptown na 1k yako walai hautakosa mwanaume wealthy. Respa you are very right my love. Jen M Joroge, wambie, I'm very right. Respa genuinely helping ladies to level up and get out of their comfort zone. Yes, Respa. Uh, hello Rispa, after getting there and ordering some wine, ukose kuaprochiwa, it doesn't matter because Rome wasn't built in one day. Mnaelewa? Hmm? Rome haiku jengwa in one day. Usipopata mtu, utarudi tena, utapata. Na kuambia wezi kosa. Kamu mengara, um, kamu mengara, na unaka smart. Hmm? Huh? Kama umengaro umekast mat, awezi kosa mtu. Hizi comments mtu anazitoaje hapa hivi. Rispa for us Muslim ladies, should we order for tea instead of wine or we can also order juice? Yes, juice. You can order, si lazima ukunye wine by the way. Uneza order a cup of tea. Unona sakumi, sakumi awa dosi wanaenda hapo hivyo kukunye high tea. Unenda na kachai kako, unakunye pole pole tu wanakuletanga kabirika hivi kadogo ka white alafu na kakikombe so una sip tu chai yako pole 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 ukingoja mtu kwa approach eh uko hivyo ndo kuna acha nisiwadanganye this is the reality of life sasa hizi tu wote tumetoka ushago mimi nimetoka webuye nikakuja nikajishindia wangu sasa hizi naishi maisha mazuri si ati nimesema sisi wanawake we don't have anything to do unaona cuz i know 60% of my age mates hawana job hakuna kazi Hakuna kazi is either you have your own business or uko na mwanaume yako na pesa that's the reality that's the truth hakuna mtu mwenye atakwambia uko ni alafu unataka mamako uko nyumbani akusaidie usaidie mamako usaidie ndugu zako lazima utafute nani anataka kuzana mtu mwenye ana pesa mtoto atendaje shule nzuri we mwenyewe ujui kizungu unataka bado watoto wako wasijue kizungu eh You want your kids to grow up and have the best what you didn't have. So of course you need to secure a good man, a wealthy man. Na sijawaambia mwende mtafute mabwana za watu. There's so many rich guy who are single. And you do you know why they are single? Because they are not getting the right women. Kwa sababu anakuita debt umevaa viraka, umevaa kitu imeshikilia tu hapa hivi tumbote iko nje na ka kitu you don't appeal to those men so that's why i'm here to shape you and help you get the most wealthiest man mwenye atakusaidia atakuinusha juu hmm? well said girlfriend faith kinyanjui thank you so much what to lie respond akieza kwambia can we hang around or if you ask me out for the same day hang around nimekwambia you have to stay busy akikwambia oh can i join you kasema ah uh, i'm actually about to leave but we can exchange contacts ivo ivo ndo unapata namba yake imagine who hang out nae akupeleke kwa nyumba yako al, nyumba yake alale na wewe akutumie then akudump how will you feel you'll feel used we don't want these men to use you unaona we want to keep them to be our husbands and our future uh, health you know you understand what i'm saying yeah so unaenda hapo hivyo day one, you pretend you're busy i just came to hang out uh treat myself and then i go back uh to my job i'm going to look for check my business but let me give you my number we can communicate further atasema eh hey, alafu hao wanapenda challenge wanapenda mwanamke mwenye anaringa ringa alafu anajifanya ako so busy atasema ah what is with this woman kwa sababu anajua kuna pesa all the women will throw themselves to him you understand rispa aki one day to tole one day to tole ki, kitabu about this one thing i love you is your humble since i saw you from Nairobi diary is your real deserved girl thank you so much uh, from today i will stop wearing my hoodies and sweatpants to restaurants why are you wearing hoodies and hoodies and sweatpants to restaurant oh my god ukiva when you're going to a restaurant na kwambia hata kama una gari uko na kibeti yako beba heels zako ziweke hapo ndani ya nini ndani ya kibeti yako tembea na tu sandals twako ukifika hivi kwa restaurant ingia kwa cho va heels tokelezea kama umedunga umengara umepaka makeup yako umengara umejispray marashi yako umetengeneza nywele yako vizuri hautakosa mwanaume 
there are so many guys out there who are wealthy, but getting the right women is the problem. So for us women, we need to really know how to quachua these men. You understand? Eh? The way you carry yourself, the way you dress, the way you talk, the way... Yeah, greetings all, greetings all watching from Italy. Esther Joseph, thank you so much. I think I've exhausted my points. Ebun Munanze Kunuliza Maswali. Which day of the week is best? Ama weekend in your poor. Apo Thursday, Friday, kelekea Sunday. Ao businessmen wamemaliza deals zao. Wana kuja tu kuji, kuji treat. You know, ma Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Ndo siku poa ya kuenda ku hangout. Na wapatika ni tu kwa restaurant, gym. Um, Unezo wapata kwa... Ata kwa Instagram wako. Because that's where I got my man from. I got him from Instagram. You understand? So, where the question? Eh, hey, mtumbai kosawa. You can buy your top 250 bob. Washe vizuri na star soft. Uipige pasi na itakuwa sawa. Also, be willing to be a co-wife. Polygamy is legal. Ah, ah, Miss Jasema mchukwe mabwana za watu. No. Nimekwambia they're very good men. Wealthy. Uko inje, maybe they're divorced. Maybe they are single fathers. Na wakona hiyo pesa na wakona kila kitu. So it's up to you. Nwe mwenye uchuzi. Kama uya fit your profile, achana nayo, enda on to the next. You understand? Mimi too, I met mine on IG. Unona Esther Joseph, ame kutana na waki kwa Instagram. Eh? No, don't text a man. No, it's like proposing. A man is the one who's supposed to propose to you. Not you proposing. Don't text a man. Ati kumuliza outing. No, let him approach you. Aki kuwe mwenye uki mtext. Inakani kama. Eh, ukona nja. Unona? Ukona nja unaitaji. What about Rispa, your student? Uh, yet you yet you aim high. You know what you follow the steps. But if we ask you what you're doing, you tell them like. Me, I have a YouTube and I'm running. Tell him I have a business. Because I'm not getting faith. Lawino, I'm not getting your question quite well, but must you be in a dress or you can be in a jumpsuit and classy pants and top? Si lazima uvae dress, acha ni wambie. Si lazima uvae dress, unezava a nice jeans, high waist with a nice fancy top. Unona hii nya nimeva pasa hizi, haka nika top. Umeva top yako na jeans na heels. Make sure umeva heels. Usiende na slippers kwa restaurant. Va heels, okay, very smart and presentable. Alafu unatembea unyo unyo, aste, aste, unaingia. Utaka kunembea kuna mwana umeata kwa approach. Okay. Um, what about us already? We have two kids. Tutapata kweli. Yes, you will get a man. Even if you have children, you will get a man. As long as you carry yourself, vizuri. Ni poa, uh, ni poa umefung, umefungua wadada macho. Esther, Esther na niambea yuko Italy. Alipata mwanamoke from, Insta, from Instagram. Saizi, anaishi maisha mzuri Italy. Mama yake uku Kenya, anamtumia pesa. Ama make sure brothers wake wako sawa. Unaona? Yeah, so I'm trying to tell you. Uh, age bracket from 25 to 30 years size. Most of us atuna kazi. Hakuna kazi kabisa. Size unapata tu job ndogo ndogo ya 15,000. 15,000 utafanya nini 15,000? Eh? 15,000 haitoshi. Rent ndo hiyo 25,000. Sasa unalipa 15,000. Mwenye utanunua nyuele sangapi. Of course, just if you're working and you're still looking for this man, just keep your job and still look for this man. Nelea, wale waku, simamisha gari mbele yako. Twinge, ama, no, 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 no. Don't enter that vehicle. Uh, you can either take a business card, ama umambie, no, don't enter. Ama umambie utamfollow na cab or something. Achukwe namba yako, lakini usinge gari ya mtu, utakani kama uko na nja, apana. Usioneshe mtu uko na nja. Of course, ndani yako, uko na hiyo nja, kabisa, unataka pesa, unataka maisha mzuri, unataka business yako iboom, unataka kila kitu. Lakini, usinge gari ya mtu. Aki na hii makeup inanishinda kulala na vile nimeplan nianze kwenda Friday. Just learn from YouTube. Uh, even if you have five, you will get a perfect match in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Amen. You're giving us hope and speaking the reality. Sonia Wambui. Yes, I know there's so many women. My age, e age bracket yetu, tunateseka sana. Hakuna kazi nzuri. Hakuna kazi yenye na fit profile yako. This generation ya kuchoma, mashule should pay attention. Yeah. 
for me, I'm talking about uh, age 25 to 30 years. What happens after he gives you his business card? Uh, just send him a text. Mwambie, uh, we met and this is my number. You can contact me. Ata kupigia. Kama umengara, umeva heels, umengara, umetengneza nyole yako, ata kukol. Lakini ukenda po even na sweatpants na slippers, ata kupigia simu. Remember, let's make this good movie comedy. My... Ah. Tena tufany, your sis, she knows me as the comedian. Good content, I like it, I love it, Rispa. Si, uh, good day. Africom Entertainment, I don't know your name, but thank you for tuning in. Uh, yeah. Wanapatikana wapi hawa wealthy men. Oh, there's some people who are just joining the live right now. Nimesha wambia penya hawa na ume wanapatikana. The wanapatikana kwa expensive restaurants kama Kempinski, kama, Villa, uh, kama Sankara, kama Hemingways. Uh, Nimuambia vile mnaenda muna kauko kwa, kwa Hemingways. Muki kunywa wainienu ya 250 bob Kenya shillings. Ama juice, ama chai, muki ngoja, watakuja. Eh? And you don't just do this every day. Utaki restaurant ikujue, ah, umu siana nakuja pa kungoja wana ume apana. Unaendapo vyo ni kama unajitreat, ujifanyo kwa na pesa. Unajua, vitu kama hizo. Yeah, so I think guys, I've exhausted all my points. For those of you who are joining right now, we're going to post this video. And so that you can watch and engage. Thank you so much, Rispa. You should be dating coach to these women. Yes, that's why I'm doing live every Wednesday so that we talk and help each other. Juzi ni mongeleju how to get pregnant. Saini mepata DM watu 30 wameshika mimba. I'm so glad. Kuna couple walika 10 years bila mtoto, but ile nyanili post imuasaidia wamepata mtoto and they're going to name their kid after me, Rispa Faith. I'm so happy. <laughs> Uyo mtutuwa kizaliwa ni minta nda kulipa hospital bill. Because I feel so blessed. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Saidi gani ni poza hoteli. Uh, Saidi ya nini? Kwa restaurant. Sindio? Kwa restaurant ama po kwa bar. Penye, unaka, penye unonekana. Yani mtu wakingia hivi. Attention yote inenda. Penye unonekana. Eh, hey, Radisson Blue, ili Aboretum, uh, places tu nzuri nzuri. Unakai yo saidi ya ba, penya mtu wa kiingia tu hivi ya nakuona, nasima, oh, there's a queen there. You know? Hey, Rispa, just to say hi. Carol Brand, thank you. Be doing this frequently. Yes. Every Wednesday, we can do twice. Nilikuwa nataka tu kuona response yenu na maipenda. So, I'll be going live at least two or thrice a week. We talk. We help each other. Akuna aja mwengine ya koju, mwengine ya kochini, unasikia viba, unasuma, oh, how did Rispa do, do it? I also want to live the life Rispa is living. It's not hard. It's not rocket science. Nwe mwenye tu present your beautiful self and you kachua yourself a wealthy man. You understand? Yeah, so let me end this. It's not yet one hour. We still have 12 minutes to go. Can we just uh, read the comments, Rispa. Mombasa tunawapata wapi? White Sands, English Point. Wapi kwengine? Na wacha nini na Nigerian men? Wacha nini na Nigerian men? Nigerian men will never, ever, ever, ever marry you. They'll always go back to their village home and marry their own. Wacha nini na Nigerian men? Tunatafuta wazungu, wa Kenya, Africans, you know? Wacha nana? Watch out a Nigerian man. Love you, Rispa Malaika King. Thank you. I love this, Elizabeth. Thank you. From Thursday to Sunday is the best day. Christine Maura, eh, the best time ni around lunchtime from 2. Kendele uko jioni. Wana kujanga kuchila hapo tu from 2. Kendele uko jioni. Yeah, so don't break a bank. It's not rocket science. People should travel too. Do you get serious men? Uh, Esther Joseph, saizi hawana pesa ya kupanda ndege. Saizi tuna aim 1,000 bob ya kununua dessert na wine peke yake. Hawana pesa ya kutravel. Sawa. So, wacha kwanza tuachukwe hawa wana ume kutoka Kempinski alafu wata travel pa moja. You understand? <laughs> yeah, should we end it? Uh, thank you guys for tuning in. Chachetu pia wako. Eh, pia kwa kanisa, by the way, kuna hawa wealthy men. Izi kanisa kubwa kubwa. Siju sita, mama ni wapi hizo. Kuna hawa baba. Eh, lakini msichukwe mapasta hawa na mabibi. <laughs> yeah, I think nime exhaust all the points. Yeah, and I'm going to post this video so that watu nyoja tune in wataiona. 
akina wapenda sana i love you guys so much eh running at karura forest on sundays by the way enda karura forest kuingia ni 100 bob kenya shillings kimbia huko hivyo mwenye umevaa ile bra ya gym hivi umefunga umevanga nzuri umevanga nzuri ya gym Sikuizi kuna bra, kuna t-shirt kwa mtumba hizi za gym. Va vizuri ungare uende Karura Forest ukimbie. Mababa wote wako na pesa wanaendanga Karura Forest kukimbia by the way acha ni swadanganye. Say hi to your family. Asante kwa kutuchanua. Thank you guys. Let me uh, go. I'm going to have lunch. Thank you so much for the chat. Love you Miriam from Zanzibar. Oh Miriam, thank you so much. Now a strainer Brian ako na brother. Yes, but ako married already. Um, the whole family is taken. Like even when I'm a bro, ah, when you are quite to Esther Chesume, thank you so much. Yeah, so thank you guys for tuning in. I appreciate each and every one of you. Now appreciate now apenda sana, and I want to wish you all the best. I pray that mpate watu wa maana mtoke kwa shida maana yake hakuna mtu anapenda shida mnaelewa eh kila mtu wa shine kila mtu wa enjoy pesa ni tamu acha niswadanganye mtu asiwahi kudanganya ati pesa ni shetani pesa ni tamu pesa ni tamu nyi watu hmm? pesa ni tamu tamu sana so make sure uh, you watch this video if you didn't watch and i love you all keep safe and let's get ourselves wealthy men Mwah. Okay, how do we end it?